Alrighty guys, so um, it is currently like November 18th today, Friday. Um, I'm actually up here in Aiken at my cousin's um, land. So tomorrow we're gonna be hunting morning and night and then Sunday um, I think we're gonna be squirrel hunting uh, the morning and then that night we're gonna go back to my dad's house we're gonna cook up whatever we get and uh, hopefully we get a couple it's gonna be kind of like a catch and cook kind of video um, so hope you guys enjoy and stay tuned Alrighty guys, so it's currently like it's 5.50 right now. Um, we're going to head out to the stand now um, for this morning hunt. See if we can't get one. We gotta bring all of our stuff out there. We got a, a little heater that we gotta bring out there and everything else. We were gonna do it last night, but it just got too late. So, But it's supposed to stay around that 12-ish. 15 degrees today hopefully we can get a deer this morning and if not this morning tonight so you guys will just have to stay tuned alrighty guys so it's currently uh 625 we just got out here in the stand um we're gonna sit till about probably 10 10 11 o'clock somewhere in there and um get down and then be back out here by like noon or one or two or something like that I don't know yet. Um, we're just gonna sit here and hopefully we see one. Like I said before, it's about it's gonna stay about 15 degrees and the buddy heater ain't working right now, so it's gonna be a little chilly. I got the deer. Dude, I'm like deaf right now. To get down and actually go and shoot it right there, cause I can still see it. She'll die. You didn't believe me at first, did you? <laughs> All of a sudden, just five of them came up. Oh my god, God, stop, dude. I think there's two big She's ones. She's hurting bad. Yeah, you got her, dude. You got her. I think you got. There was two does, and there was a couple fawns. Oh, my God, stop, man. <gasps> Did you shoot the bigger one? I think so. I couldn't tell, though. I was like, I had one of the yeah, crosshairs, like, and I'm like, like, I had four, to go. There's like four, there's like four little like ones. Freaking... There's six of them. Did this camera get any of them right here? No, because I didn't know how to push record. I told you. <laughs> or not record, but how to turn it on. Video a little bit, and then we're gonna okay, walk man. over there and go check it out. We're gonna pack some stuff up here. here so. Yeah. So as he said, there was about six of them that came in. Um, it's about quarter to nine. I went down this ridge. Um, like he said, there we did not have anything ready. The windows were closed. This tripod was in the way. I didn't know how to turn on the camera at first. Um, we'll see what kind of footage we can get out of it and. Hopefully we get something, but she looks gonna, like a nice doll. Yeah, we're gonna get down here pretty soon. And go check her out. Alrighty, guys. So this is where we were sitting up there. Um, they came in right here. They came in from down all the way back from there. They went down in here. Um, she's actually laying right there next to that log. Um, she's down. 
so I think we're gonna walk down there and um, check it out and then we're gonna head back to the camper head back to the camper and get some food and come back out and clean her up and back out here for an ice stand and so yeah we'll catch you guys then Where'd you shoot it the first time? Right there? Definitely bigger than mine. That's a good size doe, dude. Where's the trail at? Right up this hill. So we can just drag her up the hill. We're gonna drag her up the hill and we'll, uh, catch you guys up there right. An easy pass up there alrighty guys so What's he the shot the first shot he went right here and it was kind of quartering so kind of spined her and then when she dropped um, she was still moving so she shot her in the shoulder and that's what did it so I'm guessing he longed her or got her up here and then drag her up and yeah, we'll talk to you guys when uh, we get back out here. We need a knife. Knife? Where's the knife? Right there, Dingleberry. <laughs> Alrighty, guys, so we got the deer gutted. It's about 10.50 right now. Um, we got her hanged up in the shed and we ran to the store to get some water mainly. We got a couple other essentials and we'll probably go back out at 2.30. So, that being said, see you guys out there. Alrighty guys, so it's currently 5.20. We just got back here at the cabin. Um, <clears throat> I don't know what kind of footage we got out there, but about 10 minutes before we started coming in, there's actually a fawn that came through. And uh, I was gonna shoot it until I realized how small it really was. And I'm glad uh, I realized that before I took the shot. Um, but hopefully that right on camera a little bit. Um, we're thinking that it's the same fawn that was it with that doe this morning because she did the same circle route as I did this morning. 
which if I'm thinking it's it's gonna be that dole that Logan shot this morning um, so hopefully the fawn can reunite with the other doe and two fawns tonight and but we will be back out there tomorrow morning and maybe tomorrow night um, I don't know if we're actually gonna get to squirrel hunting this weekend we'll see but we're seeing quite a bit of deer so we might just go deer hunting because we still got tags to fill um, so yeah we'll see you guys in the morning Alrighty guys, so it's actually the next day now, about 9.06 in the morning. We went out this morning um, at about 6 o'clock, and uh, I had to come back early about 7.20 because I was not feeling the best, but if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. <laughs> Ready? One, two, three. <laughs>